Last week, Governor Mark Dayton proposed changes to Minnesota's poaching penalties. Now, our Justin Prince tells us how some organizations are feeling about the proposal. As of right now, illegally taking an animal or poaching includes gross misdemeanor penalties as well as a five-year revocation of hunting licenses. But Governor Dayton's latest proposal could change all that. Governor Dayton's proposal would take uh, natural resource violations and then create a felony level, which in Minnesota we presently don't have. And so that, that increases penalties pretty significantly. The proposal would also revoke game and fishing licenses for 10 years, as well as affect not only the poachers, but some organizations as well. People usually at a felony level can get some jail time and the fines go up. They can have their firearm privileges revoked under a felony. I don't think it's gonna change much for us because we just pay the um, rewards. We may see a little, but I doubt if it'll be much. The board has talked about increasing our reward amounts. And both the DNR and turn-in poachers feel measures like these could dramatically help poaching problems throughout the entire state. It, it will have the potential to, yes. I mean, I, I guess what I would say is that anybody who starts to see what the ramifications are, you would hope that that would lead them to go down a path of not poaching. I think it will help, especially once people find out what it's going to cost them or could cost them. While the proposal is still in its early stages, both the Department of Natural Resources and the turn-in poachers say that this is something they could definitely see themselves getting behind. We're definitely in favor of it, or will be, because it should cut down on the poaching and increase the opportunity for the rest of the people. Yes, yes, I think that's already happening from what I see. Commissioner Landwehr's on board with it. Um, we are behind it, we're supporting it. Both organizations also say the proposal would hopefully act as a deterrent to poachers, thus protecting Minnesota's wildlife in the future. In Brainerd, Justin Prince, Lakeland News. Anyone with information regarding poaching is asked to contact the Turn In Poachers hotline. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.